Hey, you guys. So I was um, doing some organizing and stuff like that in my um, stock room, I guess you would call it. And I came across some journals that I know that I've had for quite a while. And um, I thought, you know, I think so. Well, my first thought was that I was going to kind of go through them and I have paint on my hands. Sorry guys. Um, I was, uh, actually doing some prints with, um, leaves and stuff. So just to prove it <laughs> anyway. Um, so I'm seeking inspiration at the moment. And so I thought, well, maybe I'll grab some of my older journals and, just kind of go through them and like try to rework them a little bit. And I thought, well, you know, they've been in my shop for quite a while and maybe there's some particular reason for that. And so I started looking through them and I was like, no, you know, there's, there are ex I wouldn't change anything about them. And so I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna kind of, um, well, first of all, what I did was I marked them down a little bit. I did a 20% discount on each of these journals. And, um, you know, three of them are ring bound journals. And I know a lot of people don't really like ring bound journals. I don't particularly like making them. Um, and so I, although I am working on a couple like five ring, uh, you know, binder journals at the moment, but I just have basically stopped making ring bound journals. Um, they just don't sell as well and, um, they're kind of a pain to make. So, but anyways, I just wanted to show these to you guys because honestly, I feel like, you know, they're beautiful and, um, you know, they're pretty far down in the list. If you look in my shop and, um, look at more items, more items, more items or whatever. They're pretty far down the list. So I thought I would just kind of remind you guys of these journals <laughs> and, um, and see if maybe I could find good homes for them because honestly, like there's nothing that I would change about any of them. And, um, and I think, I think that, um, the, the discount is really fair and, um, Anyway, so I'm just going to flip through a little bit on um, a couple of these and just kind of give you an idea of what's going on. Um, these have a lot of writing space in them, I noticed. Like, that's that's one thing that um, I think is nice about them, um, especially the ring-bound ones. Lots and lots of, um, of writing space and a lot of room for someone to add their own embellishments. Um, you know, I spent a lot of time making these and, um, like for the most part, like I rounded all the corners and I inked all of the, um, the pages and stuff like that. Um, they don't have a lot of embellishment, you know, but I think, I think, uh, that's a good thing, you know, for, for different reasons. Um, lots and lots of coffee dyed paper in this one. Um, there's some, you know, vintage postage stamps and things like that. Um, a little cluster and there's some clusters throughout this one. This is one of those, this is a ring bound journal that where I did like a hinged, um, cover and the, I did make a video about this, um, quite a while ago. But the, the biggest reason that I did that is because I wanted to be able to get more in it and I wanted the cover to lay flat. And so, um, doing the hinged, um, cover really accomplished that pretty well. Um, so this journal is actually really fat. Um, anyway, so there's this one and um, this little guy is absolutely one of my favorites. Um, mainly because I love pink and orange and, um, I don't know, maybe that's why it's still there because not everybody loves pink and orange, but, um, but I definitely do. And, um, 
So this guy is, it's not hinged. Let me zoom in a little bit more. Sorry. Um, this doesn't have the hinged cover, but um, it's still actually really full. Again, you know, I rounded most of the corners and inked a lot of the pages and, um, you know, I did the reinforcements and stuff like that. Lots of writing space in, in this book. Lots of room um, for someone to add their own embellishments to. So, um, you know, lots of little pockets and tags and things like that. So... I don't think I would change anything about it, you know. It just, uh, they just are what they are. And um, at the 20% the off, I feel like, um, you know, it's not a bad deal. Plus, um, I still have a few of the little minis left that I'm giving away with any um, journal purchase. So there's that. So you'll get a free mini with any journal purchase um, until they're gone. And I did have, I think I had 20 of them. I don't know how many I have left, but not a lot. But I know I have at least five. <laughs> so, and this is, um, this is also one of my favorites. I just love the cover of this book. I just think it's so pretty. Um, so this one is done in three signatures. Yeah, three signatures. Again, lots of writing space. Um, there's a few, this, this book is very, very similar to the one that, um, I had published in, uh, Greencraft, um, recently. So yeah, a lot of writing space, a lot of pockets. Um, again, I didn't do a lot of embellishing on, on this one, um, but, and I don't know how many pages are in this book either, but and it looks like it's quite a few. Um, there's some, you know, um, vintage uh, sheet music and lots of coffee dye. This is my favorite ledger paper. This came from an old, like, counter style ledger, like from a train station. And... Um, when I got it, it was full of paper and I, and I've used like almost every single scrap of it. So, okay. So there's that one and it's got this little like loop on the front as a, as a closure. And I don't remember the exact price on all of them, but you know, you'll see. Um, and then this guy it's a really, really pretty book. Um, the cover was in great shape. Some more of that ledger paper that I just love. And each of these little pockets is filled with coffee dyed paper and um, tags and um, da 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 da. <laughs> I'm feeling silly today. Okay. So, you know, they're real similar. The, this one and that one, I think I did probably right around the same time um, as the one that uh, was, was in the magazine. So if you um, purchased that copy of Greencraft and, you know, if you were attracted to that journal, then um, just want to let you know that this one is very similar. So as the, the correct social usage one, the other, the green one that I just showed. And then, um, this one is an old trigonometry book and, um, I just love it. I love the cover. I like the texture on the cover and this, um, like border is super, super pretty. Um, it's a ring bound journal. So, you know, it's like, you have to kind of be aware of how you're turning the pages and that kind of thing. But the nice thing about ring bound books is that you can rearrange them. You can put things in different places and um, you can add to them, you know, um, and take things out. You could use a lot of this stuff that's in this book in other journals if you wanted to, you know. Um, some 
clusterish type of embellishments in here. Some. <laughs> it's funny looking through some of these older books. I forget that there, you know, there's things that I've had that, you know, I, I used and didn't remember that I even had at one point, you know. So, yeah. So I just kind of wanted to give you guys a quick flip through on some of these that I just did a discount on. I love this little like trifold um, tag. I guess you would call it. So, all right. So I just kind of wanted to do just a quick journal flip through um, and let you guys know that I had put these all on sale. And um, you're going to get, like I said, a free mini with um, with the purchase of any journal um, order on my shop right now anyway. So, and then over $50 purchase, you're also going to get free domestic shipping. So I think that's pretty cool. And the weight on just about any of these would mean that I would need to bump it up to priority shipping anyway. So um, I could safely say that you would get uh, free priority shipping um, in the United States on any of these books. So, okay, you guys, well, I'm going to get busy making some tags and um, pull out some of these other journals that I'm working on. So some of these pamphlet journals. So, all right. Well, listen, you guys take care. Thanks for watching. And um, I love you. Bye.